What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. <clears throat> I've already done three video clips. Didn't realize the camera was on time lapse. <laughs> so I gotta start all over. Week 15, day five, it's Friday. I was over at Marvin's a little while ago before lunch. I got some wood put on the fire, make sure it's still going. Then the rain clouds started rolling in. I've got a stump grinding job today over to Buddy Mine's rental property. <clears throat> There's the stump. Stumps, and uh, it's actually the property line is right in the middle of it, so he pulled that marker out for me today. Um, this is the most unconventional stump that I'm gonna have cut because it's let me see, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, there's about a cluster of eight stumps right there. I'm gonna have to get the chainsaw. I'm gonna have to knock some of it down. Also, um, another guy I know named Landon Smith with uh, Smith Landscape and, and Lawn Service, Lawn Care, Landscaping. He come out to my house way before I got the tractor with his skid steer and mulcher and man, he just tore all kind of stuff up, made it look great. Well, he did this property over here too. And, you know, it's got all that mulch stuff up on it. And uh, the property owner, he told me yesterday he was out here with a, well, he's been out here with a rake and he's made all these little piles. I, Cause I was asking about all the little fire piles. I thought they were all stumps he was trying to burn or something. No, he's been trying to clean up all the, the mulch left over from from uh, from when Landon come out here with a skid steer. So anyway, I'm gonna I got the, I brought the landscape rake with me. So after I grind on this stump, I'm gonna I'm gonna scrape him up some some of this all this mulch and then he can throw out his seed and be ready to go. Let's get the chainsaw out and uh, see what we got. There's also a hole right here. I don't know. You don't see that? It's pretty big for a yellow jacket hole. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just a mole. I'm hoping nothing comes flying out of it and stings the crap out of me. <laughs> suckage to my day. All right, where are we at? Let's get to sawing. Well, if y'all are regulars to my channel, you know the trouble I had first week or so with my new steel farm boss. So this will be a cold start. Oh, I'm gonna need some gas probably. I know it's got oil in it. I've gotten better. Oh, uh. 
Man. Good low. Now I got little ant bites all over me. <laughs> A couple <of> places.
got the stump done. That took right out an hour, maybe a little less. Now, let's go get the landscape rake on and uh, see if we can clean up this yard a little bit. I'll be right back. Well, I went to put my landscape rake on and the hitch pin was gone. I must have laid it on the side because this landscape rake and the IMAX doesn't quite meet up perfectly. You got to take the top hitch pin out. And then luckily with the hydraulic top link it makes it a lot easier. You got to hook the two bottom pieces on and then move out, uh, the, the, move the top link in. So, and then you got to throw the pin in there. You, you can't just leave the pin in. Anyway, I picked up a scraggler, my little great nephew right there. So he's going to help me out with raking this yard. Let's get to it. You ready, buddy? Let's get, get, get ready. Let's get, get ready. That's right. I've never seen a trash like this before. You haven't? Yeah. All right, watch your foot. Hang on, hang on. Let me get my leg over here. All right. Yeah. Turn the fan on. All right, let's see. Going back up. The rain's starting to get a little harder, so I'm gonna put the camera up. I'm almost done. I'll see if I can get a shot when I get finished. All right, I'm gonna call that done. I got that stump ground up. I got everything raked up to a pile in the back of the yard. He can start planting this now if he wanted to. I think that looks pretty good. All right, let's get out of the rain. I'll holler at y'all later.